Hey guys, today we are going to be taking a look into Apologia's biology course. I'm really excited. My three high schoolers will be using this next year and I want to give you guys a little peek inside and show you what you need to know if you're considering biology for next year. So let's get started. One of the things that I love about Apologia's courses for high school is that they're very flexible and any format you could possibly imagine needing for your child, they have. So they have the biology textbook. They also have the same textbook in a digital form. If your child prefers to do it off a tablet or something like that, they also have the self-paced courses, which is what my children will be using next year. This is where they have a textbook online and then it will have, it has audio options too. So if you have children who struggle with maybe some reading, dyslexia, things like that, they can listen to it as they follow along. We did choose to get the textbook as well this year. It's not required when you get the self-paced course, but we found it really helpful. Um, and so we went ahead and got that as well. They have audio options of the textbooks. And of course they have the student journal or student notebook as well. And then they additionally also have live classes and you can kind of pick and choose the different resources that help support your high schooler the best. They recently have added a sort of choose your own or build your own curriculum option to their website. And I'll link that down in the description below where you can check out their neat resources to help you find exactly what you need to meet your child's specific needs. Last year, we did the physical science using the self-paced course and really, truly loved it. I'll leave a link down below where you can find out more information about the self-paced course itself. Um, it's great because it teaches your child it has video based lessons involved. They have video where they show you doing the experiments, questions for your child to check. It gives tests and does the grading for you and so much more. But today I really want to dive into what is special about the apology of biology specifically. So let's take a look. All right, let's take a look inside of the textbook. So it has some general instructions on how you can utilize this textbook with every kind of learner. And I have loved that no matter my child, whether it's my special needs child or my neurotypical child, there is the ability to learn in the way that goes best for them. They go through different modules and each module will take a couple of weeks to complete. Now, something that's a little different with the high school is that a module will take you sometimes two weeks, sometimes more, just depending on the amount of material that needs to be covered during that section. So just be aware of that. There is a pacing guide in the self-paced course, as well as in the student notebook that I'll show you here in a second. But biology contains a total of 14 modules your child will complete. This textbook is full of lots of information, but one of the things I love is there's scripture all throughout, which is just a really awesome opportunity for your kids to understand who our creator is. I love the fact that the different vocabulary words are bolded and easy to find. There are lots of great infographics and visuals, which has been great for my learners who really are more visual with things. Just like in the younger years, you'll notice these creation connections, which help you to understand how what they're learning relates to the way that God created the world. And then they have the on your own questions that they are going to list these answers to. That is where our student book comes into play. The student book goes right alongside the teacher book. It has the entire thing broken down for you as to a grading rubrics for you as the teacher so that you can know how to properly grade the material. It teaches your child how to write notes, which I think is really helpful. And then it has the check boxes here. So you can see the different colors are coded according to the module. So this is all module two, which you can see it takes a little longer than just module one. So that's one of the major differences there. Um, and then they have little check boxes, which my kids like. And actually, as a little bonus tip, if you're wanting more record keeping, instead of just having your child check it, they can actually write the date they completed that section on, which I really like. They give some general blank pages for your child to write notes as they listen to the individual modules, but then it's really more guided beyond that. Those on your own questions that you see here in the textbook are also listed here within the curriculum within the student notebook. And so they're gonna write out their specific answers for each of those questions. Then you're going to have study guide questions. These are important for your child to be able to do. If they can go through these and check those answers and make sure they got them correctly, they'll be very well prepared for the tests built within the curriculum. So I really appreciate that aspect because studying for tests was something that was kind of new for some of my high schoolers. 
Now the first part of the book is all about notes and studying for the tests. The second part of the book is actually the experiment section. So this, we're starting back at module one, even though we're about halfway through the book. And it's gonna have the materials for each of the experiments, what you need, detailed instructions, and then it's going to walk your child through how to write a proper lab report. So here, they're going to be observing and writing down the different uh, parts of a microscope. And if you're like, how would they know that? Well, it's really simple. Within the actual lesson of the textbook, you'll see a great visual of all of those different pieces. And so they're gonna have them just write down that labeling. They then will write down their observations and write down their conclusions. And again, it walks them through how to do all of this. My kids have really grown a lot in their skills when it comes to writing these lab reports. And I love that this is a skill that will translate over into any kind of post-secondary school that they complete. As you can see, built into the actual student book are these study guides for your child that if they can pass through this, then they are able to complete the test. What I like about these is they're actually digitally on the self-paced course, so they don't have to physically write out their answers, which is really, really nice. In the back of the textbook in the appendix, you'll find helpful tools for you like a simple biological key that'll help you understand some of the concepts taught. You have a complete list of lab supplies broken up by module, which I always find very helpful. We do pair this with the lab kits from Nature's Workshop Plus. So we got both the science kit that has a lot of these and we got the dissection kit so that we have all of those supplies all in one. You definitely can piece it together yourself, but it can get costly when you're trying to get some of these things, as well as a little complicated when you're trying to get some of these very specific items that maybe are not things you can just go to your local grocery store and grab. Within these 16 modules, there's a wide variety of topics that are covered as you saw flipping through it. We've got things like the science of life and the scientific method, what is DNA, genetics and things that are hereditary, microbiology, classifications, we've got some botany things, some zoology concepts, ecology, and some of the basic human body anatomy basics. So I love the fact that it covers so many different topics at one time and fulfills all of the high school biology requirements for pretty much any state. Regardless of which option you choose to utilize in your homeschool, I think that it's safe to say that the biology course from Apologia is very thorough. It has lots of ways of engaging with the material, whether that's hands-on through experiments, visuals through the video-based lessons that you can get in self-paced course, whether it is reading or listening to the material or discussing the different questions that are there. There are a lot of ways for your kids to engage in this important curriculum. As far as the self-paced course goes, if that's something that you are looking at, I highly recommend you check out this video here. Like I said, it'll spell out more of why we love this curriculum and how it has helped to support my learners.